Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Hybrid Baby Challenge. We're here with the family, and a lot of stuff's going on. Um, it looks like the, the twins have just gotten out of school, and so I'm going to go ahead and let uh, Daphne here go ahead and... Is this Daphne? No, Catherine, excuse me. Catherine needs to go clean the bug cage, so I'm going to go let her do that. That's what she's going to start with. Uh, she's headed home. I'm going to let her get in the shower when she gets there and get stuff done. Um, she's also at home, I believe. Brittany is. Uh, she needs to get her shower done. She needs to eat. And I believe she s needs to get her homework done. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see. All right, let's turn this around. Here we go. All right, so go ahead and come on in here and take your shower. And then you can go ahead and, let's see. Go ahead and eat some of the sal is a salad made by Georgia. I can't remember. It's been so long. Yes, Georgia made the salad, the pancakes, and the stew surprise that's in there. Okay, so you guys can eat pretty much anything except for the cake. So go ahead and have the salad. Um, Jasmine here made this amazing painting, which I am in love with. What are you doing? You don't need to turn that on. So let me go ahead and take this. I would love to hang it in here, which is now our office. So if you guys didn't see the build video, you guys should definitely check it out. We did a lot of different changes, put in the office, and uh, we fixed up the bathroom, obviously. Um, we added some stuff to the house as well. Um, I was wondering who we need to get a portrait of, and I was trying to think. Brittany, I believe, has her pic portrait as a... Yeah, Brittany has her portrait as a teenager, and the girls don't matter. Catherine and Daphne are not going to count because we didn't raise them properly. So, really, we don't have anyone to paint a portrait for on that. So, instead, um, I'm going to go ahead and let her... Oh, yeah, she knows how to make all the potions, correct? Yes, young again, everything she knows how to make, so that's fine. I'm actually going to let her come out here and tend the garden. How about that? Can you do that, or did you already do that today? Oh, you already did that. Okay, so that's not going to help me. Uh, what else does she normally work on? You know, we could get her to start working on the alchemy skill if we wanted. That's another way we can roll back our age. Any way that we can roll back our age, we can definitely get them to learn. So we could do that. Um, trying to think. Trying to think. Trying to think. Um Actually, why don't you do this? Pull this over. Um, Doug Jones. Why don't you chat with T Doug Jones on the phone, and then why don't you go ahead and see if he'll come on over. All right, Jack. I need you to get break to break up with Dina Simovich, newbie. I need you to... Uh, break up with him. So what I need to do is I need to go in here. Oh my goodness, my cat just jumped in my chair. That's why my hand glitched like that. Um, and he wants to go to the park anyways. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have him invite her out. Invite out. Um, we also need to invite out Aubrey and we need to invite out Ruby Dean. Man, he's got a million girlfriends in here. It's ridiculous. Ah, it's really annoying. But we need to get to just be friends with these three girls. And then this is his ex-girlfriend. And then this is his new girlfriend, obviously, Georgia. And then Georgia's doing some stuff around the house. So that's pretty much what's going on. <sighs> Lots is going on, literally. So it's trying to get a, like all the mods and stuff like thought about. Um, Why don't you go ahead? You want to go to a park. That's a playground. We don't really want to go to a playground, do we? Um, why don't you go over here to the, uh, water hole juice bar? That should be good, I would think. Okay. So, George is just cleaning up around the house, which is good, because she does need to do that. And when he gets over there, we can totally have him, um, invite more girls out and just ask them to be friends. Um, but he's going to play the guitar while he is there as well, because he does need to do that. All right, and you're in the bathroom. Good. Um, you didn't change out of your clothes, but okay. 
And when you're done eating, go ahead and do your homework. We do need to finish teaching her everything she needs to know, though, because she only has um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. five days until she ages. And we need to have her completed. So we need to get that going as well. Romance is in the air for Nikki Barlow and Rod Bowie. Okay. So you're going to the lot. When you get there, I will probably have you um, break up with that girl, play the guitar for a bit, then go ahead and invite the other girls out. Or do it all at once. I don't know. Brenna Bowser and Kenyon Franklin were out shopping for baby supplies. Okay. It looks like he's there. So let's jump over to him really quickly. He wanted to play the guitar at a park. So I thought, why not? All right, why don't you go ahead and be mean and ask to just be friends? Isn't she a teenager? She looked like one anyways. She might not be. It just maybe she looks like one. It's a possibility. She's definitely got um, a lot of different things about her. Sure, I'll come over in a little while. Okay, so he's coming on over, which is great. And then you, my friend, need to uh, break up with... Yeah, she's definitely teen. <clears throat> but I think he was just a teen recently, so I don't think it's, like, you know, that big of a deal. Um, invite her over and invite her over. And hopefully we can get to be just friends with everyone. Especially with our daughter. That That's kind of weird. All right, so you finish that. Go ahead and head home. And when you get there, go ahead and get that homework done. All right. No, don't do that. Take a shower. Oh. Sure, I'll come over in a little while. Okay. Can you... I guess she can't figure out that she needs to take a shower. I don't know. It's weird. Following Sims have moved in with Kenyon Franklin. Okay. So these guys are just friends now. Is that what happened? No, there's still romantic interests. <sighs> you need to ask her to be just friends. Alright, and Ruby's coming over as well. Okay. He already started a group, joined their group, or disbanded to form a different group. Okay. I'm not worried about forming a group. I just want to get to be, like, friends with these girls. Cleaning up. Okay. Be chatted to. No, I want you to be chatted to. Aww, it's so sad. What? There goes Aubrey. <laughs> Catherine worked on her homework with Brittany. Okay. That's fine. I have to go now. I think it's time you left. Anyway, what? Ah, uh, this was boring. I'm not sure I can yawn hard enough to express my boredom. <clears throat> Alright, well, it's fine. Alright. So we've become just friends with her. It's fine. We're still good friends. It's not like we, like, broke it off completely. I hate to do this to poor <laughs> Aubrey because, you know, she's out on her own, no, own now. And then mom takes her, the man that she's, like, romantically involved with. And now, like, it's just mean. But anyways, um, yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and be mean and ask her to just be friends. Ooh, they're on a date? What? Weird. Come on, buddy. Ask her. Aww. I'm so sad for her. Does she even have a boyfriend? No. And our story progression is not getting her into a relationship as fast as I had hoped. I really hope she'd have kids by now, to be honest. All right. And then once you're just friends with this girl, um, that should be everyone. And then I'm going to let you play the guitar, which I'm going to have you go inside and play it, though. It's very rainy, so go here, and we'll have you play the guitar in here. Who's this? This is Nicholas Summer. He's the barista bartender. Okay. As you can tell, I've edited this lot quite a bit. I've put in the claw machine and stuff. So there's stuff in here they can do. I 
I have I would have to add chair set because I honestly didn't know you had to have chairs for it, but uh, whatever. Um, what is the matter? Why are you in such a bad mood? What do you need? You need some hunger. Okay, well, why don't you go ahead and order some food, though? Order a single serving of... Just get hot wings. You know, you can't really get that anywhere else, so... That should be good. Just get some hot wings, and you should be good. And then, uh, hopefully after that, you can play, play that. And then I'll have you go home afterwards. Alright, your painting... Well, I mean, you do need to complete that. Painting, sculpting, and venting are three things that you need to be working on. So that's fine. You go ahead and do that. Where is the guy that came over to be with you? On our computer, maybe? No. Um, watching our TV somewhere. <laughs> we have two TVs in here. <clears throat> too funny. Um, I honestly don't have a clue where he is. I don't think he's anywhere in our house, to be honest. I think he left, so you would have to invite him over again. Nope, it still says he's here. Um, oh, here he is. Come on, invite him in. Don't leave him outside, that's mean. Do a amusing greet. And then go ahead and... You can't invite in. Invite inside? Invite inside. Perfect. Okay, so that gets you go going on what you need to do. Mom, you're doing pretty much anything you want to do. I don't really have a issue. Oh, you're going to prom. You do need to do that. I hope you're in what you need to be in. Go ahead. Go to prom. I didn't even realize today was prom day. All right, and when you're done in the shower, I'll have you go ahead and eat as well. And your sister's just about done with her homework. She wants to be working on these potions. And she doesn't really need anything else. So I'm going to go ahead and let her... Let's see. You want to make a stink juice and a liquid horror. But you don't know either. So you'd have to discover a potion. Okay. Well, just fine. You can do that. And I think she's done with it. Yeah. Alright. And how are you doing in the shower? You're okay. You do need to eat, though. Eat and then do your homework. And then you should be good. I wonder if anyone has a moth, a red admiral, or a blue mycin in their inventory. Um, I would have to look. Go ahead and eat the salad, and then go ahead and do your homework. Oh, you have a blue mycin in here. Why is it not registering? There it goes. A red admiral or a moth is what you need. She just went to prom. She didn't change it to her. Oh, that's fine. Whatever. If she really doesn't want to, she really doesn't have to. Okay, where is this guy? Okay. I guess he wanted to stay outside. I have no idea. Alright. Go ahead and be friendly with him. And you can ask about his age. You can be friendly. Ask about his career. Which I think he's in the journalism career from what he's wearing. But I'm not going to assume. Ask his sign. Be friendly, and I guess you could ask about his gender preference. See if he's really into girls or if he's not. Uh, go ahead and ask about his alma mater. You could be friendly. Ask if he's single. Um, friendly. More. Get to know him. That should be pretty good. He's past how. I don't think he played at all, but he did eat, so that's good. Um, I do want to actually get him to accept the gifts. So go ahead and accept gifts from a friend. You can take your shower, and then you can go to bed when you're done with that. So go ahead and sleep. All right, so here we go. This is from... Um, lot... Um, Oh, gosh. I think you told me how to say your name. Um, Lotta Hoff. Lotta Hoffsty. I think that's what it is. Lotto. Lot, Lotta. Lotta Hoffsty. Lotta Hoffsty. I don't know. 
I apologize if I butchered it again. I know. I apologize. I'm such a bad person. It says, thank you for the plant for Lilia, Lil, Liana in my hybrid baby challenge. Well, you're so very welcome. And I hope you're doing, you're enjoying the 100 baby. I really enjoy this LP. It's one of my favorites. And um, I like the strict rules. So I like that. I like, you know, knowing exactly what I have to do. And I just feel like that's something that I like. And not everyone likes that, but I certainly do. So I hope you're, you're enjoying it and you're doing really well in it. Um, love to hear more about it if you wanted to share. But let me go ahead and take it here. We just got a Festus 44, so thank you so much for that. Um, I think this house is actually going to have more than one stove, and I know that sounds very awkward, but I think it's going to. So thanks for the stove for Jack in my hybrid baby challenge LP. All right, so let me go ahead and copy that, and I'll send that out to you. Um, let's see, moving on up. Uh, this is from Abby2193. It's a message from the game. I'm going to go ahead and take it here. And we just got a stereo. Thank you so much for that. Let me go ahead and send you back a gift as well. Um, and do stereo, which we just got to change those letters. So there we go. Thank you so much for that. And I hope you guys are all getting something great back. Um, okay. Let's see. This is from mini Amy, 2014. This is thanks for the toy chest for Lily and my hybrid baby challenge. We are so very welcome. And thank you for the diva doll poster. We can absolutely use that in someone's room. I'm sure when they actually get a room because we don't have rooms yet. So let me write poster. All right, this is from Froggy87. It's a message from the game. I'm going to go ahead and take it here. We just got a photo series hipster edition, so thank you so much for that. Let me go ahead and send you back something as well. <clears throat> so this is another photo. All right, this is from Pizzazza Girl, uh 1015 This is please give this one to Georgia and Hybrid Baby. All right, well, Jack's going to take it for her, but she will definitely get whatever it is. So let me go ahead and take it here. We just got a guitar. Thank you so much. We actually need another guitar because a lot of people want to use it. So I had to actually give the one that um, Brittany had to Jack today. So thank you so much for that. We can absolutely use that. And let me go ahead and send you back a gift. And this is guitar. All right, so that is that. I think that might even be all of my um, gifts for today. I'm not sure. Uh, moving on up, just looking for if you guys sent it to this one. Um, latte. Latte, I think. Um, this is from Stacy Play. It's the message from the game. Can you want to take it here? We just got a vampiric sunscreen. Oh my goodness. Um, what's her face wants us? So thank you so much for that. Um, oh, I'm so sorry I can't send back. That is perfect gift. So thank you, thank you, thank you for that. That's amazing. Um This is from Akina 1977. Is a thing for the lamp for Trevor and my genie family personal game. Enjoy. Well, you're so very welcome and thank you for the prim and proper sofa. Alright. Um Let's see, moving up, we have from Girly3, it's a message from the game, going to go ahead and take it here. We just got a uh, Photon Master 3000 Tabletop Edition lamp, so thank you guys so much for all the gifts, it means a lot, and uh, that helps him get some points, because it's really what he needed. Alright, people are buying, alright, she set a booby trap, but Brittany saw chaperones everywhere, oh, she wanted to, Okay. Um, they're just investing their money. Marcella's a toddler. She became romantically involved with Daniel Wang. <laughs> okay, weird last name. Uh, she really made an impression on Daniel with some epic dance moves. Georgia's completed her painting worth 44 simoleons. So go ahead and take that painting. Well, they raised me and stuff. So the least I can do is send some money their way. Okay. 
Brittany thought the backdrop for prom pictures looked amazing. Catherine's up to logic level five. Nice. We can actually share that memory for you guys because um, I'm sure you guys like to see that. Miriam is a toddler. Okay. He's 18 days older than her. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, if you became friends with him, you could drink from him, and that would be even better. Um, so compliment him. Um, give him a high five. Friendly, more. Share a secret with him. Go ahead and, let's see, play rock, paper, scissors. Whoops, click the painting. Didn't mean that. <clears throat> Go ahead and... Um, I really don't know. Be funny with him, I guess. Funny and make a silly face. And be funny and tell him a funny story. Oh, no. She really has to pee. Like, she's about to pee herself. Oh, he's evil. Oh, no. She could have just drank from him, but now she can't because... She can try when she's done with all that if she doesn't pee herself and, like, he runs away. All right, um, it's 10.33, and you're not even done with your homework yet, huh? All right, fine. Um, that's fine. I'm just going to let you sleep when you're done. And your sister needs to go to sleep as well. She's evil slumber. Um, go ahead and turn this off because you guys can't have it on, obviously. And you're in bed already, so nice. And when you get up, Actually, can I just drag this to her and give it to her and she get the credit for that? Yeah, she did. Okay, perfect. Consume plasma juice. Okay. We could do that if we can't get anything from him. That's what I'm kind of hoping we can, though. Looks like some people are getting skills. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm losing my voice, unfortunately. Chagrick Satine. Doug is evil. <laughs> She's up to charisma three. Um, Elmer Simovich newbies and El... An adult, excuse me. All right. We got a sloppy jalopy. The school dance has ended. Her curfew's an hour. Prom picture's awesome. Billy has an impressive performance. Has earned her promotion to stagehand. All right. You could go ahead and uh, be friendly and ask him about his day. I'd really like her to get married. And I know that's not really part of this, but um, I'd like her to have a husband. Um, so that's kind of what I'm trying to go f with here. He probably is going to leave. I can't think of anything else he would want to do. Oh, no, he's got to go to the bathroom. Nicholas Simovich. Okay, so Ruby Dean seems a good catch, said Nicholas Simovich. Okay. You think the books place is a pretty cool place? Oh, no. She got caught out after curfew. Ugh. All right, fine. And now mom's going to be all upset. Ah. All right, well, that's fine, whatever. All right, you're in bed. That's fine. You could go to bed if you really want to. You should have probably said good night to your friend. But if he really wants to eat those nasty pancakes that have been out all day, go for it, buddy. Like, I am not going to yell at you about that. All right, Mom, why don't you go ahead and uh, mop up this puddle? Oh, yeah, you do need to pee, don't you? Okay, hold on. Go ahead and use it. While you're in here, you might as well shower, and then you can mop up this puddle. Mop up puddle, and then you can eat your dinner. So go ahead and eat the cake, and you need to go to bed, which I think this is your bed, so go ahead and sleep. I think it is anyways. I can't remember. Um, she just got grounded. Oh, no. Shh. It's a Saturday, though, so it's okay. If she doesn't leave the house, she'll be fine. Oh, I hate it for you. I really do. It's not your fault. Janice is now a teen. Okay. Frank is now a young adult. Alyssa is now an elder. And Danielle is now a child. <laughs> That's it. You're grounded, young lady. Don't even think about leaving this house. Well, I mean, it's probably going to cross her mind. <laughs> huh. 
if only you could make teens stay when you said that something like that to them don't even think about leaving the house young lady like and then the teen just listened yeah right if that happened in real life it'd be a miracle <laughs> all right so you made a friend which is good because i do want to get you with him he's only in a he's only in like a girlfriend boyfriend relationship so it's not like we're breaking up a family, you know? Like, yeah, they may have a kid. Who knows? But there's no way I can know that. So the only way I can um, take care of it is to have him possibly move in soon. So I'm probably going to work with that with her. I do want her to get married. Um, I probably won't have kids with her until after the challenge. What I'll probably do is I'll probably let him do the same thing she's doing and just stay young with the Young Again Potion. And yeah, it adds someone else that needs to do that, but I want her to have someone and I think he's really cute. So I think it'd be really cute for them to do it and we'll just do the same thing. So it adds a bit of a chant, more of a challenge because you have to make more of those potions. Um, plus it, then you can't have as many kids in the house. Well, I mean, I could have as many as I want because I have that Enros mod in. So it doesn't really matter how many I have, but, um, yeah. So, I mean, you wouldn't be able to have as many because you would have him, but it's not like we have a full house. Anyways, we only have six people in here right now. He would be seven and, um, Aubrey would have been number eight if she hadn't moved out by now. So it's not like, you know, we're going to cut back on how many kids we can have because we can have as many as we want. So I'm not only worried about that. I just, I want her to have someone. And I feel like if I don't do it now, I may not get to be able to do that. And I eventually want to, you know, have them get married and stuff. But for right now, I just want them to, him to be her boyfriend. He's not going to move in right away anyways. They're just going to be boyfriend and girlfriend for a while. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, they'll go on some dates here and there and we'll just have some fun you know, letting Jasmine have some fun while she's dating him, and that should be good. That's what I really want to do. Ichabod is an elder, okay, and Tara is now a child. And Rod Bowie and Nikki Barlow are getting married. Gretchen Neal and Nicholas Simovich are parading their newfound affections all over town. Okay. All right, and then you can go to bed when you are done. And she cleaned up. What a nice lady. She's so nice. Yeah, you probably should go home, unfortunately. Um, but I just kind of like the fact that she has that person there, you know? He, like I said, he doesn't have to move in, but before he's, like, when he, before he dies, he does. A, disrupt, a dispute erupted between Melissa Shelley Leeson and Billy Shelley Leeson in front of the store, and both sides were left unamused. Because at the end of this challenge, uh, Jasmine is actually going to be switching back to humans so then they'll be able to have kids and it won't be vampire children and you know if they really wanted to she could have a kid before she became an adult like at the very end of the challenge maybe and um got pregnant and then afterwards once she became a human again she could always again you know have another child so really i just think it would be really cute and so that's my plans for her anyways is to get her into a relationship with someone plus she deserves to be happy you know so, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and cut out while everyone is sleeping, and I'll be back when they're getting up for their day. Be back in just a second. All right, so which one of this? Okay. Um, Catherine's up, and she was going to go eat stew surprise, and I'm telling her no because there's breakfast foods in here. Um, there's some pancakes in here that she can eat. And when she's done with that, she can go ahead and use. Now she's running. And she can evil shower. Is today the festival? No. It's not. I do want to get a picture with everyone. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. Um, oh. Jack's up. Alright, Jack. Let's get you over here to eat, buddy. So, go ahead and grab some breakfast. Grab... Oh, there is no breakfast. Alright, grab a cake, slice. Uh, George is going to have to get up and cook for everyone then. Unfortunately. And Georgia also wants to see Jasmine get married. So, that's the thing. Ooh, we do need to go grab that. Go grab that. Hold on, let me go over here for a second. I'm going to have Jasmine pick this stuff up. So go ahead and pick this. You can go ahead and pick this up. You can pick this. You can pick this. And I think there's another one back here. A couple more, actually. It's Catherine's birthday, and it's Daphne's birthday. So we're going to have two more teens in the house, so that's fine. It's exciting. Good stuff. 
Ooh, plasma fruit. Yes. I'm so excited for that seed. I've been waiting for that to pop for us to get that so that she can have plasma fruit. And then uh, what I'll do is I'll probably make her food with it. And um, I think even if they make food with it, it helps them. I don't remember exactly. Brittany will be graduating soon. All right. So I do need to mark off what Brittany needs to do still. Um, I need to mark off that she went to prom because obviously that's done. Um, right. Jack, go ahead and clean up, please. And if you could put this book away, that would be amazing. And then what do you want to do? You want to learn the handiness skill, play a game at the park, send a text to Alyssa Akers. Well, we could do that really quickly. Who's Alyssa Akers? No idea. No ideas. I'm guessing it's like your boss. Look how much identical they look. Um, I'm excited to see what they're going to look like when they, um, when they age, you know? Um, all right, so she's found a mushroom, an un unknown special seed. Yay! Uh, Melissa Shelley Leeson and Billy Shelley Leeson are awaiting a new addition to their family. All right, so they're going to have a baby. Jack, when you're done, I think you need to use the bathroom a little bit. So go ahead and use shower. Um, and then Catherine, yeah, you could play with that if you really want to. That's fine. I'm, I'm okay with that. So you go ahead and do that. Um, all right, so I was saying let's mark off what Brittany's done so that we know what she's done with and what she's not done with, you know? Oh, I have so much on my desk right now because I was eating dinner and so I have like my dinner stuff on my desk and it's like crowding me and I'm feeling claustrophobic and it's really bad. Um, where's my pen? I lost my pen again. Are you serious? I'm not happy about this. Not happy about this. All right, so she went to prom. All right, so the only thing she needs to do are um, learn to drive, uh, do five pranks at the house, and successfully prank the school, and she will be done. So mom needs to finish teaching her to drive today. That is something that we need to do today. Um, we cannot wait another day. We have to finish that. And she needs to prank the ha do pranks on the house as well today. All right. You go ahead and come on home. Have a quick meal of uh, plasma orange juice. And then I will let you go ahead and use the bathroom next. So you can use and you can shower. And what does he want to do? Meet a supernatural. You're not going on a date with Ruby. Learn the social networking skill. Okay. You could actually do that. Let's go ahead and have you just do that right now. Go ahead and social networking. Uh, browse the web, go ahead and stream a video, go ahead and browse the web some more, stream another video, go ahead and browse the web again. I've just sneezed, hold on. <coughs> oh man, sorry about that. Browse the web, stream a video, browse the web, stream a video. Browse the web. Stream a video. Browse the web. Stream a video. That should be pretty good, I would think. Okay, so what? All right, they were strolling on the sidewalk. Yeah, well, what? A quickie marriage. They got a... Oh, they're having a baby now. Ugh. Jasmine's behaving inappropriately. Where's Jasmine? Uh, Jasmine's at her own house, so if you don't like it, you can leave. You want to improve your charisma? Okay, we could absolutely do that. You just grasp the basics of social networking, so there we go. That's done. Quick and easy to complete. All right, you want to play horseshoes with the sim, improve your charisma. We have all these mirrors, so let's see. How is your skill doing? Um, let's see. Charisma, here we are. It's maxed. You need one more friend, and that is it. So you need to make friends with someone. You could probably make friends with Jack, I would guess. So friendly, go ahead and, well, does it really matter about charisma? I mean, we can work on it, but, well, I guess it's the only thing she really has to work on right now. So go ahead and ask about his day. You can go ahead and be friendly and gossip with him. You can give him a high five. 
you can go ahead and let's see chat with him some more and that should be good what are you doing all right um you can eat some of the autumn salad and then when you're done you can go ahead and use you can go ahead and take a shower okay you my child be scared no use shower and then you want to learn you want to take a class in the painting oh okay well you want to also want to rake a leaf pile before the leaves all go away we better get that done or did the leaves already all go away hmm that's not good that's not good at all there's some more seeds over there that she could have picked up oh you know what you need to do actually you need to find these butterflies so you need a red admiral and a moth only problem is your map tags are not popping up so it's gonna take me a long time to find them because the fact is I can't find them that's the problem all right we need to get you to the school you want to take a, a a painting class so go ahead and attend the painting class and that'll be fine and then uh, I guess you could rake a leaf pile like right here just rake I don't know if you really want to do it that's a perfect place to do it all right you want to get a telescope play catch with Daphne and you want to make these potions all right well go ahead and why don't you discover a potion you go ahead and get off that phone travel to Egypt create a new blog we could do that you could be our blog creator hopefully you guys are not gonna stand there because you're gonna be right in the way of this poor child to do what she wants to do oh yeah you totally are gonna stand there aren't you jerk faces alright fine I'll just move it over here so that she can actually get to it alright so this is Daphne nope Catherine Catherine go ahead and discover potions some more Ruby Dean and Nicholas Simovich have taken the next step and are now going steady okay Jasmine's friendly yeah we know and he's happy with what everything that's going on there whoa whoa that's a little bit weird be nice kids be good kids be good all right be friendly oh okay so there we go she got it you want to use an elixir I'm actually gonna have you use that vampire vamp oh my goodness no you're not kissing Jack you can use that vampiric sunscreen so go ahead and use this elixir on self and then we'll take you actually don't use it yet go to the park then use it because we're gonna have you go to the park and we're gonna have you uh, play the guitar oh and we got the new guitar so we could actually pop that into your inventory when you actually get there so that'd be cool all right, there's a garden. Eh, I don't really want to go to a garden. Where do you want to go? I want to go outside, but it's so rainy. It's so crappy. Um, we could actually go to the festival. I think that's classified as a park. And if you go inside, there's plenty of space in here to actually play on the inside. But, I mean, what's the point of using the vampiric sunscreen then, you know? But it's okay. Go here. Actually, go here with, <clears throat> go here with Jack. Since you guys both want to play the guitar on, at a park, um, he's got the guitar, so that's fine. Um, you don't. I have to get you a guitar. I have to get you the one out of the inventory. So let me jump back over to you and grab that out really quickly and put that in your inventory real quick. And then when you guys get over there, you guys both could play for a little while at the park. And that should be good. You guys might go outside when you're over there. So if you do go outside... What I'll probably have to do is I'll probably have to just um, have you use that elixir, which it's fine if you use it. Um, actually, I want to take the other stuff out of here as well. Uh, what do we got? We got a couch, which there's a couch over here. But I just realized that there's TVs over here, and there's no couches to sit and watch them, so it's kind of funky. So let's go ahead and put some of this over here, and we'll put the lamp here so that they can see. Um, there's a stereo here. I don't see a stereo over here. So I'm going to put one here. I think we've got plenty of stereos, but it's fine. I am not going to sell this. Like I said, I think we're going to have two stoves in the house. Um, the reason I think this is because I think it's going to be like this. It's going to go next to each other. So it looks like we have a really big stove. We're going to have a 
nice kitchen here. So, you know, we're not going to want crappy stuff in here. All right, I really don't know where I'm going to put this. So I'm just going to kind of stick it right there for right now. And for this, I'll just stick it in here. I don't know. It's just until we figure something else out for it, I'm just going to stick it there. She's reached the current maximum level of charisma. Okay. She's got a star now as well. Okay, well, that's fine. Doug Jones and Christy Jones got engaged. Yeah, I'm not very happy. Oh, they only got engaged. Wait, wait, wait. They are only engaged if they're not married. Okay, well, if they're only engaged, we could totally, like, still weasel our way in there. No, they're married. See, that's what I don't like. I want, I wanted to get with him. I think I'm still going to try because, I mean, we were trying yesterday and it was going well, so. No reason to stop now. What are you doing? Stop. You don't got to make the bed. You need to actually cook up a breakfasty food. So before it's gone, go ahead and serve brunch. Make up some uh, waffles for everyone, I guess. And um, that looks weird that they're different colored. What is in here for leftovers? Autumn salads and stew surprise. Um, you can make up some peanut butter and jelly as well. That way we'll have lots of food for everyone. And uh, when you're done with all that, you'll probably eat, I would guess. And then you can go ahead and take care of this this house a bit. All right. And you need to answer your phone first of all. Um, all right. So that's Danielle Wang. Sure, you can chat with him if you really want. I don't care. I love that girl scarfy thing. It's cool. All right, so everyone is pretty busy at this very moment. All right, they're there. I'm going to go ahead and have you just practice chess until your mom's ready to go. And then what I'll do is I'll have you, um, I'll have you, uh, learn to drive in just a second. All right, go ahead and play alone. And does Georgia need the car? I think, I'm thinking she does. Yeah, she definitely needs it. And you go ahead and play alone as well. And hopefully you guys will find a place inside. If not, what I'll do is I'll let you get the, the wishes done. And then I'll go ahead and have you just um, switch. I'll have them, like, change what they're doing. All right, you want to learn the cooking skill? You're not kissing Jack. I'm sorry. You want to jam with Jack? And what do you want to do? Send a text to Jasmine? I mean, I guess. Go ahead. Text. Friendly. All right, so they'll stay over here and strum for a little while at the park, and that'll be good for them. They'll actually start to make some friends with the people who watch them, too, so that's cool. So they will have a few more people. Maybe we don't know them yet, and maybe we'll become friends with them. All right, so she made the stink juice potion, which I believe is something she wanted to make. Right? Oh, yeah, you need to attend the game. Too loud. Jumping out of there because I don't want to deal with that. Oh, you're gonna go clean up the gar or clean up the garbage. Okay, that's fine. You can do that. How's it going, mom? You just got the waffles made. Yeah, I'm gonna put those away for you. There you go. They're in there now. And she took a painting class. Okay. Um. All right. What's this? No. Come over here and discover another potion. You need to discover the liquid horror potion now. And you just build up that logic skill, which will be fine. Oh, yeah, mom's going to have to let you off the hook before she can teach you to drive as well. Does she really need to do this right now? No, not really. I think they've started already, so fight. Lecture. <laughs> let her off the hook, and then... um. Maybe she can ask to learn to drive. I think this car is actually got to be on the lot. I think it's got to be placed here. And then I think she can teach her to drive. Let off the hook. That's all I'm getting. Um, you could apologize as well if you wanted to. I mean, it's not like you were in the wrong, but... You probably act overreacted to everything that was going on. She was at prom. All right. Your mom's trying to talk with you. Can you ask your mom to teach you to drive? Beg for forgiveness. Um, 
The only other thing I can think of is look in her hair and see if she's already got her driver's certificate. And I'm not seeing it, so... Uh, another thing I can do is I can try and go up into map view and jump over here to the school and see if she could take the class to drive, attend the driving class, yeah. I wonder if it's because um, she, oh, she needs to play for that as well. All right, we'll have to get that done then too. Um, I wonder if it's because she's grounded that she can't ask. So we'll see what happens after they, she forgives her. Well, I mean, she's trying to let you off the hook. I mean, come on, work with me here. All right, here we go. Sorry, I didn't know you were at prom. <laughs> All right, now can you teach her to drive? Yeah, so now she could. But first, let's get her to eat. Is there anything she could just quickly eat and she doesn't have to sit down and eat? I mean, yeah, she made this, so she probably should just grab a plate. But I was trying to do it quickly. <clears throat> probably not. All right, then you can go ahead and teach your daughter to drive. And she can go back to practicing chess. And are you guys still strumming? Yeah, you guys are still strumming. Okay, good. All right, you finished that one. You want to paint and you want to play in the leaf pile. Well, you need to go attend the free game is what you really need to do. So let's get you over there to do that because that's important. We need to get that done. Um, you actually, you guys actually age up today. She can do this as a teen though, so that's fine. I don't know about the attend a game one. I've never done it as a teen. I've always done it as a child, so I do want to get that done because that's pretty important, I think. Um, is she going to the game? No. Why are you not going to the game? Ten oh, it's over. All right, fine. Come on home. Fine. <laughs> All right, how are you guys doing on needs? You guys are fine. I'm going to let you guys keep going. I don't have a problem with you guys staying out there for a while. We do need to um, get birthday cakes for the girls. And we need to make sure that we age them up. Not that it matters, but... We could just let them do it automatically. But to be nice, be fair, um, we'll let them go ahead and use this. All right, don't worry about cleaning up. I'll clean up for you. Because I want you to teach your daughter that. She really needs to get some of this stuff done. Which means she needs to start pranking the house as well. And I have a few ideas of what we can start doing for that. Can you not... Can I not drag this into here? Are all of these full or something? And I can't even pull it into that one. This is ridiculous. Alright, fine. Alright, stop. Your mom wants to talk to you. And... How about this? Can you clean this up for me? No, don't watch it. Clean that up. Clean that up. Why don't you go ahead and take out the trash for me? That would be amazing. If I could get you to do that, I would be very happy. And once these guys are done learning to drive, or once she's done learning to drive, I guess, I'll go ahead and have her, um, I'll have them come back home, if everyone come back home. Probably should get everyone to come back home now, because I don't think it's going to take them very long. Um, but if they're not done by, like, 6.30, I'm going to have the girls age up, so that's just how that works. All right, you guys go on out, you guys learn to drive, and then you guys should be good. Come on, get out there and do it. Yeah, I just want to see the bar of how close she really is. Shadow Simovich has passed on. Okay. That umbrella's broken. I'm going to have to get her a new one. How close are you on this? Ooh, I think she's really close. I think this might even be her last bar. So they might be done in like a half an hour's time. Um, so I'm actually going to get you to stop strumming and come on home. And I'm going to get you to stop strumming and come on home as well. You guys got to spend quite a bit of time out there, so that's good. When you come home, go ahead and pick this up. And if you could clean up that as well, that'd be great. And you want to build your handiness skill. What I want him to start doing um, is I want him to start upgrading the stuff around the house. And I think that'd like, be the best thing. You want to take a greeting card picture? Mm, jam with another sim, I guess. Um... 
Yes, yeah, so like 6.30. If they're not done by 6.30, the girls are going to age up anyways. Or even just 7. Um, Alright, why don't you go ahead and stop for, for a bit and go ahead and use the bathroom. And then come on in here. I really wish I knew how close they were. There we go. See, they're done. Alright, so she's learned to drive. So that's good. So go here with your mom. And that'll be good. And we'll get the girls to age up in just a second when everyone gets home. All right. Um, you can come on in here. Uh, and you go ahead and come in here. Nope. Come back in here. All right. So let's go ahead and just let the girls blow out their candles. So Catherine first. Daphne. There. There. So there we go. Two birthdays going on at the same time. She learned how to drive, which is nice. I'm going to mark that off. And then I'll know she just has the last two things to uh, finish. And these girls, it's not going to matter because they didn't age it properly before. Okay, so we're getting pretty close here with uh, Brittany, making sure she's got everything done. Like I said, she's got to just got to do the pranks now. And then she'll be good. So the girls are aging up. He's very inappropriate. You can tell because uh, he's laughing at them. Yep. Inappropriate. <laughs> That's fine. And let's see. Alright. The girls are going to age up. And then we'll end it there. And then I can fix up their clothes and hair in the next episode. Alright, so is this Catherine? Yeah, Catherine, and we need to choose a train for, trait for her. Go ahead and, okay, adventurous. There we go. That's your trait. Wow, she really needs to change up her looks. That's fine. We'll do it. And then just waiting on Daphne to age up, and then we'll be good from there. Jack, do you really got to eat right now? Really? Oh, I guess. Poor Daphne. Everyone stopped watching except for her mother and her older sister. Oh, wait. No. I guess Brittany's still watching. I don't know. All right. So she witnessed Catherine age up into a teen. So that's good. And then here we are with Daphne. What happened? Um. Well, I mean, I would have, but we had other things that we really needed to get done. So sorry about that. All right. We got to choose a trait for Daphne now. Go ahead and easily impressed. All right, so I will do a special episode of, like, fixing up their looks so we don't have to do it on camera. But that is everyone. Everyone is getting older as it comes along. We'll get a closer look at both Daphne and Catherine in the special episode when we do their looks. But, uh, guys, this is where I'm going to end it for this episode. So if you guys liked it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. Um, in the description below is a donation link if you would like to donate to my channel. That would be amazing, but if not, it's totally optional and it's not a big deal. Also, there are two other links. One is to my Twitter and one is to my Twitch if you would like to follow me there. There's other links in the description as well, so definitely check it out. See what's down there. There's a lot of links and stuff down there, so if you want to go check that out, that would be great. And I will talk to you guys in my very next one. Thanks very much for watching.